Man. It's happening, guys. And I got some proof. What's good, y'all, man? It is your boy, Sniper Kicks. In today's video, man, it is going to be a banger, man. I'm going to talk about the Jordan 1 Lost and Founds. And I got some information for you guys regarding the shock drop. And I'm going to give you guys proof. Proof that there will be a shock drop on the Jordan 1 Lost and Founds. But before we get into the video, guys, make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Make sure you smash that like button. And of course, smash that notification bell. Because when I get information on shoes or getting shoes for retail or anything regarding sneakers i'm going to let you guys know as you guys know from the jordan 4 thunder release once i told you guys it was going to be a shock drop and guess what there was a shock drop on the jordan 4 thunder so guys let me know in the comment section below if you copped the jordan 4 thunders on the shock drop but we are waiting we are waiting for the jordan one lost and founds this shoe right here is the shoe of 2022 this shoe was insane the sneaker app went ballistic this release by far was the craziest release ever on the sneakers app and the app literally glitched there was pending for like two hours and we are getting a shot drop and i'm going to give you guys some information and some proof of why we are going to get a shot drop so guys as you guys know the sneakers app has been hinting that there was going to be a shot drop they said hey if they are going to drop the jordan one lost a thousand next week are you going to tell the group chat or are you going to zip your mouth and as you know at sniper kicks i'm going to tell the group chat so guys we're going to rewind a little bit we're going to rewind a little bit we were supposed to get a shot drop of the Jordan 1 Lost and Founds back in January. As you guys know, there's a lot of craze around, hey, we're getting a shot drop, we're getting a shot drop, and they loaded pairs on back end. So I wanna talk about back end right now because a lot of people are just sneaker heads and they don't know the technology behind websites and apps and all those different things. So when a website like the sneakers app or Nike.com wants to load something in their system, there is a back end where they have to actually load the stock and put the style code, put all those different things in the system so it can actually go live. The reason why we knew about the Jordan 4 Thunders was because they had to put the pairs in back end. And technology is so good today that we can go past and see what is going on on the back end. That's the reason why we knew we knew the exact time, the exact date that there was going to be a shot drop on the Jordan 4 Thunders. And that's the reason why Nike's almost leaking it out itself because they know like technology is so good. There's no such thing as a shot drop anymore. There is no such thing because we can tell with the technology. With my Discord, we have all the monitors. We have all the you know Nike stock. Art. We can tell everything that is going on on the Nike sneakers app because the technology. And I'm luckily my Discord has all that technology. But back in January, again, we're rewinding. Nike had pairs on back end. They loaded pairs of the Jordan 1 Lost and Founds. So we were supposed to get a drop. And I'm going to give you guys some screenshots right here of back in January when they actually put it on back end. As you see right here, pairs were loaded. And on top of that, there was a decent amount of stock. Again, when it says low, medium, high, it's relative to the stock. But as you see, those bigger sizes had a good amount of stock. I know you guys are getting excited right now because I'm getting excited. So again, back in January, they had pairs loaded on back end and we didn't get the drop. We did not get the drop because again, there are so many leaks. I made a video, every single YouTuber made a video on the Jordan 1 Lost and Found restock back in January. So Nike's like, guess what? We're not gonna do it. There's too many things that are going on right now. Everybody knows, everybody is alert. We are not going to go with the shock drop. So we have been waiting patiently now, patiently for this shock drop since Nike pulled the pairs back in January and everybody was like, man, there's no restock happening anymore. They pulled them. And you got to remember, there was an instance before with the Jackie Robinson Ducks and the Orange Lobsters where we were supposed to get a shot drop one day. They had pairs loaded on back end and then they pulled it back because everybody knew and they did it like a day or two later. Nike is known for doing things like that. When people are knowing, hey, we're going to pull it back. We're going to do it on a different day. So that's what they did with the Jordan Lost and Fouts. But as you guys see with their actual posts, 
they know they have lost and found in the chamber and they're like, if there's going to be a shot drop next week, are you going to zip it or are you going to tell the group chat? They did the same exact thing with the Jordan 4 Thunders. They released them early. Are you going to be team early or are you going to wait for release day? And as you guys know, they did the shot drop on the Jordan 4 Thunder and they leaked the information to us because Nike knows the technology is way too good. They cannot hide anything. There's no such thing as a shot drop. Back in the day, man, 2017, you know, 2018, when those Jordan 1 UNC off-whites came out, nobody knew about that shot drop because, again, the technology wasn't great back then. But now we can tell with every single cook group and every single thing we have the technology. So that shows you right there that Nike sneaker app does have pairs of the Jordan 1 Lost and Founds. Those pairs right there that was on back in, back in January just didn't disappear, guys. They did not disappear. They still got them. So, Snipe Gang, as I promised, I was going to let you guys know there was going to be a shot drop on the Jordan 1 Lost and Founds. So I'm making this video right here, and now I'm doing it on my phone, is because it is happening tomorrow. It is happening tomorrow. I kind of leaked it earlier today. I leaked it with some stock numbers earlier today, but it is confirmed. Make sure you hit that notification bell on. It is going live. It is going live. It is going live. You already know. Stiver K got your back. Hit that notification bell. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Let's go. Guys, make sure you have your notification bells right now. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel right now. Because as soon as I get information on that, I will let you guys know. Again, like I said in my Discord, we have all that technology that we can see. When pairs are on back end, it usually comes out maybe a day after or two after. And it tells you the date when they're going to drop it. Again, technology is so good. That's why botting is so prevalent today because the technology is so good. And technology can always, you know, bypass whatever Nike is trying to do. So that's why we knew about the Jordan 4 Thunders. And that's why we knew there was going to be a shot drop on the Jordan 1 Lost and Found Chicago. So I want you guys to cop Snipe Gang. I want us to eat the Jordan 1 Lost and Founds. But let's go back in the sizes. If you look at these sizes right here, if you look at the smaller sizes, like those grade school men's sizes, there's not that many. But when you start going down, it's is high, medium, high, high, high. So it's kind of getting me excited because this shoe right here is a masterpiece in my opinion. It's a Jordan 1 Chicago and then you got the vintage look. I know back when they dropped, there were some moldy pairs right here, but I'm hoping there's no moldy pairs on this restock. So guys, I'm going to keep you guys updated. Nike's like, like, hey, since everybody knows already, let's leak the information ourselves. Let's leak it ourselves to the public instead of these cook groups and guys like Sniper Kicks leaking it. Let's just us leak it. So again, I'm going to keep you guys updated, updated, updated. With the Jordan 4 Thunders, people were pending for like 35 minutes. It is going to be the same thing for the Jordan 1 Lost and Founds because at the end of the day, man, they got to try to decipher the bots. Because as you see, since we know things that are on back end, bots are going to be prepared for the Jordan 1 Lost and Founds. And guess what? The biggest bots in the world are going to be ready for the Jordan 1 Lost and Founds. So there's going to be a lot of different pendings on there because again, Nike sneakers have kind of decipher which is a real person or which is a bot so there's a lot of different things that are going on right here but i wanted to tell you guys this is proof so this is going to be absolutely crazy guys i wanted to get this information to you guys again make sure you're subscribed to the channel smash that notification bell because i'm going to keep you guys updated on top of that guys we went live today on the jordan one wash pinks and overall this is a very very decent shoe there will be pre-order access tomorrow on top of that with this shoe as well very clean has that short suede the quality on it is absolutely amazing and we're going to go on live tomorrow for the pre-order access people are able to cop in store but there will be a pre-order so make sure you have your notification bells on because when i go live exclusive access is going to go live if you took an l on the thunders guys do not panic there's a lot a lot of stock of the Jordan 4 Thunders and it's coming out May 13th. There's going to be a lot of different chances to cop this sneaker. So do not panic. There will be exclusive access. There will be sneakers. There will be full locker. Every big box retailer, every retailer that has a Jordan account will be getting the Jordan 4 Thunders. So do not panic on that. And again, I'm going to keep you guys updated and teach you guys how to cop shoes for retail. But I cannot wait, guys. The Jordan 1 Lost and Found is going to come soon. Technology Day, we can tell when it's about to go down. Really do appreciate you guys for watching this video, man. We're going to keep this thing moving. You already know Snipe Gang is stock. And let's get it. Sniper kicks out. Peace.